On this Tuesday, we're going to be praying to go beyond our hardships in life. I remind you today and any day to send your prayer request into Positive Christianity. Let us pray with you in a positive way, believing the best, believing in the miracles of what God can and will do. Simply reply to any positive daily inspiration or go to our website and submit through there. So many people have allowed a hardship to define their lives. They had something happen at some time and they find it difficult to get beyond that, sometimes years or decades after the hardship. And when that is the case, they often live their life to tell their story about the hardship, becoming a professional victim. That is living in a hellish state. It is time to claim heaven. Let us pray. Dear God, I do not want to be defined by any hardships in my life. I want to be defined by the good times. I want to radiate that inside of myself to myself and radiate it from myself to other people. I have gone with your help beyond my hardships this moment in time. I'm on a new path, an ascending path towards a lifestyle that lives in the kingdom of God. I focus on the good. I eliminate the bad in my thinking. I focus on wonderful, blissful thoughts. I focus not on things and misfortunes that have happened to me in the past, but the good that is happening now and will happen with your blessing. Dear God, I pray that you will help me to go beyond anything that has happened to me in my past and that I will not think about or dwell upon my past any longer. The past is past. Help me to become a victor in life, a person that is empowered by you, a person that is infilled with you. Infill my mind right now with visions that are spiritual of what I can and will be. Infill me with a spiritual presence that infills me at my core and gives me the courage to get up from where I've been sitting too long. I pray that you will transmute any hardship memory inside of me. Use it as a fuel, a spiritual fuel, to, to energize my future. I pray that I will no longer just feed from it, uh, thinking that it is of importance it is absolutely of no importance any longer. The story no longer has to be told. It is canceled. It is removed from my consciousness. I no longer need this. I no longer want this. I decree with the power of Jesus Christ that it is eliminated from my mind, my memory, and my hurt. I am a person that is ready and willing excited and equipped to move forward and I so will it in my free will and it is done. It is something that is happening now and will continue to happen and new blessings will come to me because I'm no longer restricting myself in the past in any way. This is a new day, and I have a new vision of God, and I have a new vision of my life, and a new vision of myself beyond hardship into the victor lane of victory. In Jesus Christ's name, I decree that it is so. I will continually receive the help from God that I need so that I will never move back. 
Amen.